Hey, this is John from JY Guitar Studio. In this lesson, we're gonna learn how to play Alice by the Sisters of Mercy. It's a great song for beginners. It takes place entirely on the top two strings of the guitar, and it's all single notes. There's a little faster than you might be comfortable with, but there's a lot of open strings in between the fretted notes, so it gives you a little more time to get your fingers where they need to be. Here's the intro. It's an eight bar intro, and the first two bars go like this. So slowing that down, it's your pinky starts on the 8th fret of the 2nd string, followed by the 2nd string open twice. Then it's the 7th fret on that 2nd string still, with your ring finger. And then the 5th fret on that 2nd string, with your index finger. So those first notes go like this together. Then I slide everything down and I line my index finger over the second fret and I play the third fret with my middle finger followed by the fifth fret with my pinky twice. Then I play with my index finger on that second fret and the pinky on the fifth fret again twice. And then the first fret with my index finger and then the open string. That might not be comfortable for you if you have small hands or arthritis or something like that. So in that case, you might want to try playing it with your index finger on the third fret and using your ring finger to play that fifth fret. Then you slide the whole thing down again and just kind of jump up with your pinky. So you don't have to make a big stretch, you're just kind of rocking your whole hand. After you play that, move your fingers all the way back up to where you started, pinky back on the 8th fret. And this time though, you're going to play the 8th fret and just hold it for the duration of... You're just going to play... Followed by the 7th fret. So it sounds like this. So with the pinky on the 8th fret, just play that note. Followed by the ring finger on the 7th fret and then the open string twice. Then it's the 5th fret with your index finger just one time, followed by the open note ones. And then this part is exactly the same way as you played it the first time through, with your index finger hovering over that 2nd fret, play the 3rd fret, followed by the 5th fret twice. So 3rd fret, 5th fret, 2nd fret, 5th fret, 1st fret, open. Now for the, what amounts to be the 5th and 6th bars of the intro, it starts to sound more like what you think of, I think, when you hear Alice. So you actually play that twice exactly the same way. And that's just the 8th fret followed by the open string twice. 7th fret followed by the open string twice. 5th fret followed by the open string once. And then it's the same pattern you've been playing for the previous uh, four bars. That's the whole intro. This next part is what comes to mind when you think of Alice. And that's should look a little bit familiar to you. The intro is just the 8th fret with your pinky, followed by the open string twice, 7th fret with your ring finger, and open string twice, 5th fret once with your index finger, and then open. This part's a little different now. You're going to use your middle finger on the 3rd fret, 
followed by the open string twice. Then the second fret's gonna play with your index finger, followed by the open string twice. And then you're gonna play the second and third fret. So the whole thing again goes. And you come back up to the eighth fret and you play it again. You're gonna play that four times. And at that part, it moves over to the first string and that riff is a little bit different. Here's what you're gonna play on the first string. I'll play it all the way through and then I'll walk you through it. So what we're doing is the first bit is the same as you've been playing, just on the first string. You slide down to the third fret, and I use my index finger for that. Then the fifth fret, and the seventh fret. And then you start over again. But this time you're gonna play. So it's third fret, probably the open string twice. Fifth fret, probably the open string twice. Third fret, once, probably the open string once. And then you go back to the second string and you're going to play the verse riff. You're only playing that twice through here. So the next part is the chorus, and it goes like this. To play the chorus, start with your index finger on the fifth fret of the second string and your ring finger or your pinky on the seventh fret of the first string. You're making a little power chord here. So then you move on down to the third fret with your index finger and slide up to the fifth fret on that second string. And then top it off with the seventh fret on the first string. And then the next little bit go like this. So it's fifth fret on the second string and the seventh fret on the first string. And you're going to end with a hammer on to the, the uh, seventh fret of the second string. And a hammer on is just picking the note, uh, picking one note, and then dropping a finger on the same string on a different fret. And it comes out of that and it goes into the main riff. end the song when it comes out of the very last chorus instead of doing the hammer on and starting back over it just goes a hammer on and plays the open second string and that's the whole song thanks for watching hope you found this helpful if you did please like and subscribe and make sure you click the link in the description below to see the written lesson for this song and the download for the tablature that I wrote out for you.